Hello everyone! Welcome on back to the Hunger Games Challenge. And today, we're gonna have a death challenge. Oh, what is this? Renera felt confident in her belief in the supernatural. Something about the last ghost sighting unnerved her. Seeing as believing, and now Renera can't get the thought out of her head that ghosts could be everywhere. <laughs> in this challenge, they are, honey. Always watching, always ready to jump out and scare at any moment, which I'm pretty sure they can die from that. Anyways, so we do have a death challenge. I was gonna do something like obvious and traditional to the Sims 4, or Sims in general, but we did drowning last time. So I think since I saw Simone, I'll get more telescopes and maybe, just maybe someone will die by a meteor. But, you know, we'll get to that when the time comes. We have Chaperone's ghost just hanging about. Um, if you remember, Katniss was the one that won the reward house, and she was, like, on the verge of death. Oh my god, is she actually going to use the bed in here? <laughs> Congratulations, girlfriend. She is going to use that bed. <laughs> Lovely. Any hoosies. And then, let's see, what else do we have going on? Um, sleeping, sleeping, playing games. Oh my gosh. Even though she was, like, talking about the ghost, she's just playing with chaperone on the chess table. Let's see how everyone's needs are doing. So, Gypsy, oh, Gypsy's in a bush sleeping. Love it. Hunger is meh. Hygiene's horrible. But overall, it's not, like... We, we, we could get her up or she could get her own needs up. Rhaenyra is always, like, fighting to stay alive. Like, And by fighting to stay alive, I mean, like, she's always getting the plates, her sleep. She she keeps her needs up for the most part pretty good. I know there was one time where they were all pretty low and I was, like, a little nervous for her. But she's doing good here. Steven, he's in the bed. He has to pee. Hunger's going down. But everyone's hunger is going down. Oh, but Simone has good hunger. And let's see, Katniss, of course, she's getting her energy. She has a reward house. I wouldn't expect her needs to be horrible. So we'll have them, like, hang out, see if they do anything cool. I'll let Katniss have the reward house for at least one day. And then, oh, what's going on out here? And then we'll do the death challenge. Oh my gosh, Rainier is just, like, terrified of ghosts. I'm not sure what that's all about. Ah. I mean, there's a lot of death in her show and everything. Ah. In her family. I would think, like, that that whole place is, like, haunted that she lives at. And then she's just talking to Chapel, like, mm, You're scaring me, but I do have you. Oh, and now she's gonna haunt something. She misses her piano, Chapel. Oh. Man, I I can never make it in time. Like, when someone leaves the bed, I can't make it in time to put it back up so there is, like, another death aspect to this Hunger Games. I just can't. What if she puts the bed up when someone's laying in it? I mean, she won't. Maybe. There we go. Okay, I made it in time. <laughs> Good on me. Good on me for adding a death risk to this already death old Hunger Games. Is that a word? Question mark? <laughs> uh oh. Oh no. No, 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 no. Oh my gosh, we had not seen that before. Well, that's proof that someone can definitely die from the Murphy bed. She's like, yeah, I'm not gonna sleep there now. That thing's out to get me. Ooh, Gypsy, sorry. Rhaenyra decided to nap on the bed. Maybe not fully sleep in case it, like, crushes her. But she'll nap on the bed. I gotta call a reward. Or a little bit. I gotta call a repairman for my reward house. You know, for one of the, like, fancier options, it's already broken. <laughs> <gasps> <laughs> oh, 
<gasps> oh, gypsy. I don't know how many times some of these people have been gobbled up by a cow plant. So I don't know how many times they have until they die from cow plant. Oh my god, he is so upset. What a sensitive soul. I'm so sorry, sir. Oh god, who's sleeping in the dirty bush? It's Simone. Disgusting. Alright, let's see. Okay. Alright, so I just, like... She's hiring a repairman right now. What's, what's he gonna think, like, coming to this house? I mean, luckily he's coming today and not tomorrow when we have the death challenge, but, like... At least... Yeah, okay. It's gonna be awkward. Okay, so I kind of feel bad. What do you mean it doesn't need my service? Sir, do you not see this? This is broken. Oh my god. This dumb fool. Does he not know that we have a secret house in the back? Anyways, I feel bad because Gypsy's probably hungry, but she's in the shower, but... That's the Hunger Games, right? There's a lot of people sleeping and stuff. Ugh. Alright. I'm gonna put the food out. Okay. okay, everyone, as you remember, we dropped our meals down to two instead of three for people to get. We have some excellent Yorkshire pudding this morning. So who's hungry enough that they're gonna get it? All power turned off for the next 12 hours. No, I didn't plan ahead. I didn't see that on the calendar. I only saw that it was the TV season premiere. Wait a minute. I can't even watch the TV season premiere because my power's out. This is ridiculous. Oh. Well, there is a light on in here still somehow. They're probably like, you wouldn't be able to see your Sims. Steven got one. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Who's gonna get the other one? <gasps> Looks like Simone's coming in. Is she gonna grab it? Is she hungry? Oh no, she has to. She has the pee so bad. She's doing the pee pee dance. Anyone else do the pee pee dance when they were younger? Or or still do the pee pee dance? <laughs> and then Katniss comes over just to see how everyone's doing and cleans up the dirty dishes. How nice of her. She didn't brag about how she had her own food. Just came over to say hi. And love days tomorrow. Man, so many holidays and things happening right now. We got con Conserve Your Power. We got TV season premiere. We got Love Day. I wonder what she ate. I actually didn't see what she ate, but she... she Probably had a really good meal due to the reward house and everything, but, you know, Katniss lives in a poor district, so she's probably like, wow, that was amazing food. <gasps> and Gypsy got the other one. Alright, but don't worry, folks. We will be giving out meals at dinner time. So... This this doesn't dictate anything in the Hunger Games. Unless you're like really bad up on your needs. Yeah, and Avon Rhaenyra's hunger isn't that bad, so sh she should make it till tonight, no problem. I like how the butler just like comes in here and talks to everyone. She like she wants a social life, she wants to talk to everyone, but then she also experiences like the tragedy when people die. <laughs> the mourning, all that. How does no one ever know that someone's in the bathroom? You know how many people are embarrassed due to like them walking in on someone or someone walking in on them? Like, I don't know. If someone died of an emotion in this Hunger Games, I feel like it would be like very, very embarrassed. What the hell? It said that man fixed this tub. It is not fixed. Okay, well, this isn't a money challenge. We're just going to replace it. That bullshit. I want to sue that company. They didn't do shit. <laughs> Uh-oh, this is a bad sign, though. Ooh, that is too. 
They both be teasing with that cake. Mm. We already know Rhaenyra loves hanging out with them. Gosh, Steven. He's... He is constantly mourning someone. He's also scared about, like, drowning and stuff. Calm down, it's okay, it's okay. They're your friends still. They may be ghosts, but they're still your friends. Or the fact, like, water can't hurt you, Steven. You're not in the water. People's relationships right now, by the way. Well, Gypsy has Simone with her, like, highest relation. Um, Nira has a good relation with most people. Looks like Steven has the most. Oh, good compatibility. Eh? I love that. I love it when they have that, but I wish they would do something about it, if I'm being honest. Let's see. Oh. Okay. Cool. And then, of course, uh, looks like... Mm. Wait, that's so weird, because when I go to the Stevens, I don't even see Rhaenyra. Oh, no, she is. Never mind. Oh, and he's still scared of water. All right, all right. and then Katniss, who's your highest relation? Is it Rhaenyra? Could be Rhaenyra. Also, even though Kendrick's... Wait, isn't he dead? Why does it show like he's alive? What the hell? Oh wait, maybe it shows. No, what the hell? Why do these people not have ghosts for their profile? Also, Kendrick swallowed because I had to reset my drivers, so CC is ruined. <laughs> Let's try this one more time. The shower is broken. Air repair service. Oh my god, funny situation. We have another break. Uh, last time we didn't fix our bath, but we now have a shower that's broken, so maybe that'll be easier for you to comprehend and fix. Thanks. Bye. Stop saying it looks like my place doesn't need services. Are you freaking blind? Replace. Because everyone's stupid. At the plumbing office. Oh, I can't put the bed up because of the power conservation. Alright, well, you guys made it safe for this round. At least in terms of, like, trying to sleep on the Murphy bed. <laughs> Seriously, because the power is out, I can't make certain foods? Bacon cupcakes? What the heck? 9pm? Should I wait till 9pm? So you give them like um something more dinner appropriate than a salad. Who is Bess? And why is she calling? Ignore. <laughs> Ignore like most phone calls I get. <laughs> All right. I mean, even though Steven's freaking out, once again I put out dinner, which we could only make salad. So I got watermelon salad here. And of course, Rhaenyra has been hungry, so she's like, I'm gonna get it. Oh, Steven, having breakfast and dinner today. Good for you. Sorry, Gypsy. Oh gosh, what do you... Oh no. Oh no. Oh my gosh, look at her relationship with the stuffed animal, because she always like hits it and stuff. It's literally red, that's hilarious. Okay, power's back on. Let me put this bed up. <gasps> uh oh, oh! I feel like that Murphy bed is getting more and more unstable. It didn't even go down that time. Oh my god, I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous for whoever wants to use that next. I mean, it went down simply for uh, Steven, even though now he's not even going to use it. Why do they do this? Why would you bring the bed down, that you can sleep in a nice comfy bed, and then nap on the couch? Oh, look who's here! It's Kendrick! Oh, but look! He's not bald here! He has his hair! 
Y'all pick. Y'all pick your boy. Talking with friends. Oh, Gypsy. We love having you in this house. You bring excitement. <laughs> oh no, Katniss. She enjoyed her bubble bath and now she's gonna eat the watermelon salad over here while people are starving. So typical of the reward house winners. Or is she gonna give it to Gypsy? Just think about her. <laughs> Gypsy's so upset. Did you really have to bring that salad over here to tease me? I'm gonna look on my phone. You know, I'm really hungry. I could use food. See, Steven? Even though you're mourning constantly, your friends will come back to talk to you as ghosts. Oh. And now he's haunting the radio. I, you know what's funny? I feel like the ghosts are haunting things that they like or would use. Chaperone uh, haunted the piano and now Kendrick Lamar is haunting the radio. That's kind of rude, Steven. That's your friend. This is awkward. <laughs> oh my god. He's gonna go swimming. That's gonna trigger Steven even more. Steven! You literally just- you have the fear of, like, water and swimming. Even Kendrick is mourning. But, like, aren't you all in the afterlife together? Ooh, or did, like, Don go to hell? You, everyone else went to heaven or something? Like, what's the deal with it, right? Calm down, calm down, you're a ghost. Rhaenyra wants to have a baby. She needs that successful lineage, you know? <laughs> oh my god, ghost, please stop. Every time you guys break something, I have to buy it. Because the plumber, or the repairman, whoever, just doesn't see that it's broken. <laughs> he's embarrassed, probably, because he's, like, haunting as she's, like, taking a poo. <laughs> it's love day. Oh my gosh. The butler cannot stand being around a sim she has a grudge against? My gosh! Who hurt you? Is she? Does she not like Katniss? Okay. That's so awkward. Oh, Steven and Rhaenyra, they became good friends. And on Love Day. And she wants the baby. Maybe they'll get together. But well, someone will probably die. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, you don't get attached. At least not that much. Oh. Okay, but who got the potion this time? Okay. Okay. Who who got the potion this time? Okay, still the butler. Good because. Oh. What's going on here? Are they just like celebrating their friendship? I don't know what's going on. That's cute. Close connection. Okay. And we have voting. My God, so much. Alrighty. Oh, so let me put these meals out. It's delicious eggs Benedict. That's a gourmet meal, everyone. It might be normal, but still. If I was going to get a meal in the Hunger Games, I mean, I hope to get most of the meals because I don't want to starve, but... Yum, eggs benedict. And Gypsy's like, oh hell yeah. I didn't have this in jail. Rhaenyra! Oh my god, is she even that hungry? She's only a little hungry and she like, I want that eggs benedict. I mean, so the royal treatment, I would like that. Thank you very much. Delicious. Oh my gosh, Simone. She is starving. Again, I feel bad when they like shower and stuff, but some people are sleeping, some people are showering. They're not all gonna be ready when the meals come out, and they already know that I put them out around 8. Okay, but before we get started, I realize maybe one of my mods is working. So, 
they have like a whole romance thing. She's like jealous. She likes, she's by, let's say, Rhaenyra. Oh, fear of death, fear of ghosts. Oh my gosh. But let's see. Men, but she will woohoo with men and women. Ooh. Let's see, let's see. Uh huh. Interesting, interesting. I mean, on this love day, we should be seeing something, right? Even if there is no relationships going on. And let's see. Romance with women, but will woohoo with men and women. Oh my. Okay, okay. And then Simone. She just romance and woohoo's with both. She's totally bi too. Love that for all of them. And then Katniss, romance men, but we'll woohoo with men and women. Beautiful. That's love day for them, everyone. We get to see their like preferences and romance and stuff. <laughs> Relationship preferences, my bad there. Correcting myself. I think it's the time because this challenge might be a while. But I'm gonna I'm gonna set some telescopes up, and um, we're gonna try to have a death by meteor. So one moment, please. All right, and then before we begin, sorry, Katniss, you do not get to be in the reward house anymore. All right, so Katniss doesn't have reward house access anymore. I'm trying to make everyone come out here to start observing the sky. I don't think it matters if people are like get there at the same time. I just hope they continue to observe the sky. That's going to be the hard part. And this might take a while. But, you know, hopefully the thing happens for challenge reasons, not because I hate people. <laughs> What are they laughing at? What do you think they saw? A dick-shaped cloud? Like, what was it? <laughs> uh, oh, Steven got over his uh, fear of swimming. Kind of. <gasps> oh my gosh, it's happening. It's happening. All right, um, um, okay, let me get everyone else inside, I guess. Oh my gosh. Everyone else is leaving. I don't know if it affects other people around the sim, so I'm just making everyone go inside. Small. Leave. Oh no. Oh no, she's terrified. It's coming. It's a bird. It's a plane. It's a meteorite. And it's headed right for Katniss. Houston, we have a problem. Oh no! Oh no! More do? More do? And then there were four. No. Steven's like, not another one! At least you still have your friend Rhaenyra because you guys just became good friends. And last time that happened, your friend died. Which would chapel road. <laughs> oh my gosh. She just like had the reward house. You know, at least she, what's this person? Random person just walking by. Oh my god, someone's dead here. What was all that commotion? A meteor? Oh my god. You know what? She lived her last few hours in the reward house, getting her needs a hundred percent. And now, oh, Katniss is a loner. Loner sims are happiest in solitude and are wary of groups of strangers. Ma'am, you are surrounded by people right now. <laughs> Look at all the neighbors. Except I don't think they live here. I'm sure you live in Sulani, but I love how they like all come over. Wow, look at that meteor though. Can someone like do something about that? All right. There it is! Katniss may have survived her original Hunger Games, but not The Sims 4 Hunger Games. She was joy she was close. She has been added to our gravesite. Oh, so sad. 
<laughs> she's asleep though. She's tired. Oh my gosh. Okay. Actually, Gypsy doesn't really care. But everyone else is pretty sad over the matter. And of course, Steven just keeps losing people left and right. Oh, wait, he's not mourning Katniss. He's mourning Chapel. Okay. He's like, yeah, that's sad, but it just makes me think of my original good friend, Chapel Road. Anywho, that was the death challenge, everyone. Oh, and then Death's like, well, I don't think we can have another death over here, so let me just check check the sky right now. So Katniss has died. It's very sad. But that's going to be it for today. Um, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know what you think, who you want to win. We have four final people now. We now have Simone, Steven, which, oh my gosh, two of the Olympians to start with, they are, you know, built different for a reason or they're just very lucky. And then we have Rhaenyra and Gypsy. So <sighs> next time we'll be doing just a reward house challenge. Um, but who knows? People die in those as well. I hope you have a great day, night, afternoon, whatever time zone you're in. And I'll see y'all next time. Bye!